Hello, Nuri. Hello, teacher. How Good evening. Are you? A little tired, teacher. <clears throat> Why? My back, my back hurt. From working? Yes. I used so much uh, my hand. Oh, okay. Do you do like massages or something? No, no, I, I work in, in the hair, using the dryer. Okay. Interesting. Yes. That's why my back hurts, my hands. It hurts your hands, yeah. Yeah. Let me check one thing. Happy teacher day. Hey, thank you very much. <laughs> Did your children go to school today? No. No. Okay. There's Miguel. Hi, hi, Miguel, how are you? Hello, Miguel, how are you? Hey, how are you? Hey, how are you, teacher? Happy teacher day. Hey, thank you. Thank you for you. Thank you. How was your day? It was a normal day. <laughs> <laughs> it, it, it rained very hard today, no? Yeah, it rained hard. Yeah. Rain. Mm -hmm. It rained very hard in your, in your area? Yeah, it's very hard. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm watching some videos here in, um, in YouTube and, and, and it, it looks, it looks like, um, it looks like there will be problems. It looks like there will be problems tomorrow. Yeah, many three fall down, it fell down. Yeah, that's what I saw. <clears throat> but you know, that always happens. I mean, it, it's always gonna happen, I think. All right, welcome, Ivania. Hello, good evening. Good evening, hello, Marvin, Doris, and me, <laughs> Nuri. Did the rain catch you today? No, teacher, here in Santa Ana, didn't rain today. It hasn't rained? Oh, lucky you. It rained very, very hard here in San Salvador. At least in my area, it rained very hard. I don't know in your area, the rest of the people. Yes, here too. Check. Have you noticed there's a lot of concerts coming to El Salvador? Yes. I was thinking about that. I was watching that, uh, that Carol, 
Carol G. Mm -hmm. And I was thinking uh, about that. Maybe because mm, it's, it's less dangerous. But you know, Carol G, I, I understand because I don't like her music, but I know that she's popular in this moment. Yes, she is. But like, Vilma Palma Vampiros, man, really? I, I remember Vilma Palma Vampiros like 30 years ago. They were very, very famous and I liked them. I went to see them. But listen to this. I saw Vilma Palma when they were famous, famosos, like big, mm -hmm. big famous. When they were okay, y, y tocaron en Liverpool, un, un bar que se llamaba en San Salvador, Liverpool. Ya andaban quemados. Pero <clears throat> now they're back. But no new music, they're just, they're back. But I was reading and it's the COVID. You know, like, because artists, they don't sell music anymore, so they need to make concerts. So they really need to make concerts. Okay, let's let's see this video. Let me share the screen with you. Okay. Can you hear? No. Hello. Yes. Hey, Hello? you. Yes. Tell me if you can hear. No. We're about to finish advanced. Yes. Two, yes. Which okay. means we're yes. closer no, to complete no, yes. English course. Okay, thank Pay you. attention to the last topic. Non-defining relative clauses as sentence modifiers. You can use non-defining relative clauses with which to make a comment about an entire sentence. I have three cats, which means there's usually a lot of cat fur on my clothes. My roommate is a slob, which is why I want to get my own apartment. Non-defining relative clauses as sentence modifiers. In these relative clauses, the relative pronoun which refers not to a particular noun, but to the whole idea in the main clause. Non-defining relative clauses are always the second clause in a two-clause sentence. Because these clauses are non-defining, they are set off from the main clause by a comma. This type of non-defining relative clause adds information or a comment that applies to the first clause, but it is not essential information. That cannot be used to begin a non-defining relative clause. For example, laptop computers are easy to carry which is why many people travel with one. People enjoy playing video games, which means new software titles come out all the time. If you notice, these clauses make a comment on the complete sentence as opposed to commenting on just the noun. To finish up, type three sentences using which to make a comment. Okay, everybody give me one example. I'll, I'll give you one in this moment. Today it rained a lot, which means tomorrow there will be a lot of traffic in San Salvador because of the floods. Do you know what is a flood? No. A, fl a, a flood is, is, I don't know if you saw Constitution Boulevard today in the rain. Have you seen videos of the Constitution Boulevard? Yes, inundation, a flood. So listen to my example. Today, it rained a lot today in the afternoon, which means tomorrow morning, there will be a lot of traffic because of the floods today, the consequences. Yes, no, maybe. We don't want to talk today. Are you cold? Sleepy? Hello. Hey, Alexander, how are you? Teacher. What's up? Uh, you know, I have 
I have a problem with my internet because uh, uh, my, my, uh, I am connected my computer in my uh, Wi-Fi of the phone. Okay. Sometimes I lost that. Yes, you sound like uh, Android. Okay, thank you very much. No problem, R2D2. <laughs> no, it's, yeah, no, no, C3PO is right, C3PO. Hello, Ibania. <laughs> okay. Hello, Alexander. <laughs> I have an example, teacher. Yes. Um, my father is free this weekend, uh, which means we are going to spend time together. Very good. Very good example, good. Marvin, can you give an example? Yes, yeah, teacher. Um, Today uh, didn't rain, which means uh, all the people is going to um, get out the clothes to the, to the sun. Summer clothes. Summer clothes. Okay, all right. <clears throat> Miguel, do you have an example? Sure. Okay. Yeah. My son got COVID, which means he's going to be in quarantine. Good. You have a son? Yes. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. How old is your son? And 20 years old. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Your son is 20. Yes. How old are you? I'm 47. Get out of here. You're 47? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And it's real, he has COVID? Yes, he, he made the test today and then notice what the, he has COVID. It's okay? Yes, okay, he just had a, a little headache and just that, just, 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 just that. Okay, good. But he's in quarantine? Yes, he's in quarantine. Okay, yeah, that's good. Okay. So you had your son when you were 27? Uh, 25. 25, okay. Cool. Have you had COVID? Yes, I got COVID in last September. Oh, I remember. I think I, I think I remember that you had. Yes. You had COVID. All right, good. Which hey, means... you teacher? Oh man, yeah, I had COVID. I when I got I got COVID, when I got COVID is when do you remember? COVID, I think, was one, two years ago, right? Yes. I got COVID during the quarantine. So oh. that was that was when if you get COVID, oh, my God, oh, my God, burn that house, burn the house. <laughs> you know, it, like, you know, everybody thought that I was going to die. Now it's normal. <laughs> Somebody has COVID, they do COVID. Oh, no, no. Yeah. Um, but in that time, no, it's like. I think my family secretly they paid a funeral for me. Secretly. Everybody called me crying. Oh my God, are you okay? <laughs> yeah. No, but I did I did have terrible symptoms. I promise you I did have terrible symptoms. And um, maybe those injections help. Did did your son take the injections? He has uh, just to yeah, okay. Man, I had every possible symptom. I had fever, I had body ache. Um, I lost my my sense of smell and taste. That was I think I get uh Omicron. Oh you did? Yes, I traveled um on December to United States. Oh, okay. So I, when I return, when I come back, I have fever, headache, and flu. 
and I took the, the test and I was positive. <laughs> oh man. Yeah. That was crazy. I, I was in quarantine on December 20, uh, 31. But, but, oh man, you really. <laughs> New Year Eve. So you were from the window. Happy New Year. Yes. It was the uh, the present teacher. Oh man. I yeah. was crying. <laughs> yes. Ni llevan a quiere pan. No. <laughs> and they give it to you like with a stick here. <laughs> and you take it like thank you. But you know what? I I will be honest with you. Yes, okay. The good side the good side of, of my COVID, I really enjoyed it because yeah. I don't remember how many years it had been. I was two weeks in my room. <laughs> my, my, ho my house is a little big, so I have a room at the end, which is this room by, by it's like the studio. And I was two weeks free, like no wife, no son. Me on TV, I watch so many Netflix. Um, and, and the cool part is like people, tu comida, oh, thank you. Yeah. Like, like a hotel, you know, I open the door, thank you. And then finished. <laughs> I, yeah, I, I kind of enjoyed that because I never, I will never have those, those two weeks again. <laughs> yes, I was like, what? What TV show do I watch today? What what TV? What movie? <laughs> <laughs> People in the United States were a little crazy. They didn't use masks, correct? Yeah. Yeah, people are a little controversy. Controversial in the United States. Okay, let's do this. It says instructions. Match the statements with appropriate noun defining clauses. I want to give all all up. I want to give away all my old books. What do you think this one is? Look, it's Can plural. I teacher? Yeah, please go ahead. Which means I have to get boxes for them. Yes, for them. I think for them is the clue because old books, we're speaking plural, which means I have to get boxes for them. I have locked my keys in my car. What happens when you lock the key in your house, in your car? Yeah, which is why you saw me open it with a coat, coat hanger. Yes. yes. All right, class. Have you ever done that? Have you ever had to open your 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 car like this? No, I pay for that. <laughs> you know what I did one time? Um, I left my keys inside inside um, the Spencer on Juan like during Christmas and I called this person and this person came in the motorcycle and he got like a little bag and he put it in the door and he pumped pump, pump, pump. Yeah. the door opened and he just boom pulled it two minutes tops $30 te $35 <laughs> yes <laughs> so I go to Marketplace in Facebook and I saw that little bag. Fifteen dollars. He like, I bought it, but I ha I have never used it. <laughs> oh my god! Yes, yeah, so I'm always waiting. Like maybe I see a neighbor or somebody, you know. Hey, wait a minute. Let me help you. But I have I have that bag. All right. Let's do number three. I'm going to repaint my room next week. Which is why I've been saving all newspaper. All right, good. 
that's why I love Dollar City. That Dollar City is, they have a big plastic for painting. Because now have you noticed it's more difficult to get newspapers because nobody really buys newspaper anymore. So um, in Dollar City, I think it's $2. They have the big plastic paper for painting. Oh, really? Yeah. I have never seen that. Yeah, go, go where the paint section is, the, the paint brushes, you know, and you will see the plastic like you put under. And it's good because you can reuse it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, number four, it says, my son made a robot custom for himself. <laughs> Which is why he was covered in aluminum foil yesterday. <laughs> yes. Which is why he was covered in aluminum foil. And that is... This one. Number five, our neighbor saves her empty jars for my dad. Which is great since he uses them to store nails and things in his uh, work room. Yes, it's good. Do you know what is an empty jar? Mm. Um. A jar is like, have you ever bought like um, pepinillos in, in a jar? Uh, glass. Oh. Yeah, the glass, the glass jar. Yeah. Normally people after the jar, they, 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 they finish using it, but some people know they use it for other things. I think in Buffalo Wings, you drink from a jar. Yeah. Mm-hmm. My new cell phone can store and play music. It is great because I can listen to it while I'm on the subway. Awesome. This example is a little old because can you imagine my new cell phone can store and play music? That is something very, very, very basic today. It's easy to get lost when driving in a new city. Which is why personal navigation systems were developed for cars. Good. Um, do, what do you use, Google Maps or Waze? Mm, in my case, both, but I think it's better Waze. Yeah. Okay, number eight, uh, it says, Adam still listens to music on an old fashioned record player. Which is strange since cassettes, cassettes. What is the pronunciation of cassettes? Cassettes, cassettes yes. Cassettes and CDs have been around to, for so long now. Okay, good. So it says, Adam still listens to music old-fashioned record player. Oh, okay. So then, yeah, so this example is very, very old because, which is strange because now we say, hoy la onda es CDs and cassettes. <laughs> you know, if you ask a 15-year-old person, hey, everybody say, well, ¿qué es CD? <laughs> what is a CD? All right, cool, we got them all right. And many people don't use CDs uh, at the moment, right? No. Well, I don't think people use CDs. Um, I, I still have a lot of movies and DVDs and I don't have a DVD player. <laughs> I have a DVD, but I don't use. You don't? Do you remember Laserdisc? No. Okay, but okay, like, look, Michael Jackson, Pink Floyd, y todo esto siempre va a tener los discos más vendidos de la historia. 
Hmm. You, do you know why? No. Okay. Because they were they were alive in the best time to be a musician. Mm. Let me give you an example. The mm. transaction from disc to cassette to CD. Yes. So when Michael Jackson took out Bath, he sold 5 million copies mm -hmm. in discs. And then the new invention, cassette. So then the same people, they bought the cassette. Okay, oh no, I, I want to have it in cassette now. And then the CD came out. And probably the same people, hey, no, I want to buy that one in CD. So many people bought the same album maybe three times. Mm. And for the artist, that was great. <laughs> yeah. Because, and now the artists, they don't sell music, they sell nothing, they sell concerts. That's why you see Michael Jackson sold 300 million albums. Of course, yes, mm. because, yes, but it's, it's logical because he sold the same album in many different um, formats. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's do this. Let's do the listening part. Extra instructions. Listen to a news report, then choose the correct answer. Our technology report this evening is on making the world a smaller place. Linda? Thanks, Ted. These days, with college students studying in different cities or even abroad, families spread all over the world, and even more office employees working with overseas companies, people are looking for better ways to communicate with each other. Many people already use video calling with family, friends, and business associates, and as this technology continues to improve, even more people will be using this helpful communication tool. It used to be that video calling meant seeing unclear faces, hearing bad audio, and losing the internet connection. Now, the images are sharp, the sound is clear, and people stay connected for the entire call. People can communicate with each other as if they were in the same room, even though they are in faraway places. Additionally, video calling isn't just for computers. Many people are using video calling apps with their smartphones, making it even easier to connect anywhere, anytime. With this technology, the world gets smaller and smaller. Don't you think that's a good thing, Ted? I sure do. Thanks, Linda. This has been our technology report. All right. So the woman says that more people are using video calling. calling. Very good. To to communicate online. Yes. More people are able to use video calling because the software, the software has been really improved. Yes. Good. Older video calling had problems such as unclear audio. Uh, what is the correct pronunciation? Unclear, unclear audio audio. audio? Unclear audio. Audio. Uh, audio. Audio. Ow. Ow. Audio. Audio. How many audio. syllables in audio? How many what? Syllables. Syllables. Audio. Hey, hey, just one. Audio. Audio. Three. Three, three. Because uh, the A and the U is connected because it's, it's not really the letter, it's the sound. Ow, D, O. Ow, D, O. Ow, D, O. Audio. Mm -hmm. Okay, it says today's video calling feature 
clear sound and pitch. Clear Where's sound the and pitch. Good. Where's pitch, teacher? Yeah. Sorry. What is the meaning of pitch? Yeah, you know what? Um, it's like como finesse. Let me let me do this for you. Because that that word really doesn't exist in Spanish. Oh, okay. I said pitch. I had to watch. Mm -hmm. No pitch, but I had to watch. Pitch is justo. 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 That's why you you hear sometimes the expression say pitch perfect. Justo y like. Okay. Pitch. Me diste justo en el. Pero justo en eso, no justo de a. Hey, es justo que se vayan mitad y mitad. No. Justo es mm -hmm. como cabalito. Okay. Justo en el blanco. Ah, ya. Yeah. Eso es pitch cabal. Yes. Cabal. <laughs> Thank you. No, you're welcome. Okay, let's listen to part two. It says, listen to students, talk with uh, her career counselor, then check true or false. Hi, Jenny. Please sit down. What can I do for you today? Well, I'm graduating soon, and I just can't seem to choose a career path to follow. I'm interested in so many things. That's a good thing. It means you have more choices. Now, I know that you're a person who is disciplined and motivated. Am I right? Yes. I like to work, and I'm good at budgeting my time. And let's see. You studied history and politics. Good. What about extracurricular activities? Well, I wrote some articles for the college newspaper, and last summer I volunteered at an archaeological site. That was fascinating. What did you do exactly? I helped tag the items that were found and enter them into a computer database. There was a lot of information to organize. So you are someone who is organized. Great. And you have a lot of patience. Yes, I would say so. An archaeological dig is not very exciting. It's interesting, but there's a lot of waiting and watching. Well, Jenny, have you considered being a reporter? You seem to enjoy writing, and your background matches up very well. I did enjoy writing for the college newspaper, but do you think I have the right qualities? Reporters need to be disciplined and motivated, like you. And your background in history and politics means you're informed about the world around you. Hmm, it seems like a good idea. I think you'd make an excellent reporter, and I have the names of a few local reporters for you to contact. You could talk to a few of them and maybe spend a day with one of them. You know, see what it's like. That sounds great. I'd love to do that. Here you go, and good luck. Keep me posted on your progress, okay? Okay, thanks. Jenny is disciplined and motivated to work. True or false? True. True. Jenny majored in history and politics. True or false? False. 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 True. True. Hmm. False. I don't it's know. I'm gonna go the democratic way. False. Yeah. Jenny has never written for a newspaper before. False. 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 Jenny thinks archaeology is exciting. False. True. It's true. True. Uh -huh. Her uh, counselor wants her to try news, pay, news reporting. It's true. True. All right, let's see. Okay. Yep. It's all true, people. Okay, next it says be complete sentences. Instructions, complete the sentences with the passive of verbs in parentheses. Just type in the verbs in its correct form. No capital letters or period is needed. No capital letter or period is needed. 
in the future, more online courses blank by people with busy schedules. Will be taken. Will be taken. So it says I just put taken, right? Yeah. Will be taken. Will be. Will be. Oh, no capital. Will be taken. I can't yeah. shut down my computer unit, all of my files. Have been done now. Yeah, have been downloaded. 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 These days, chat rooms blank by universities to host students' discussions. Are being used. Are, being used. are used or are being used? Are being used. Are being used. Are being used. Yeah, both are correct, actually, but I'll see a keys. <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah, but both are correct. ¿Saben por qué yo me fuera más con these days? Porque it's talking about present time, but not in a specific present time. So it's a simple present. Remember when I explained to you? Simple present is something you do in the present time. For example, mm -hmm. Ivania works in MAH in present time. She's not there in this moment. It's no, just really. that, uh-huh, porque si no sería, eh, she's working mm -hmm. in yeah. imagine. So, esta de entrada dice, these days, chat rooms mm -hmm. are used mm -hmm. by universities to host. But, okay, they're both correct. But just, if, if you remember what I told you, if you ever want to ask yourself what's the difference, that is the difference between simple present and present progressive. Uh, present continuous. The two presents are now, yes. The only difference is that one is an action happening in this moment and one is an active action in the present time. Number four, Sam blank, his dream job at an internet farming company. Has been offered. Has been offered. This can be, this can be also past, but has been. Because this can, this can be passed too. Sam was offered his dream job. What is your dream job, class? Dream job. Mm -hmm. my, my dream job is my job. present job. <laughs> really? Yes. Yes. In my Okay. My dream job is to be Scarlett Johansson's anything. <laughs> this is not a job. A dream job. <laughs> well, I, I, I'll be anything. I'll wash your shoes, driver, whatever, but just. <laughs> okay. That's my dream job. Okay, number four. Mm -hmm. Sam blank his dream job at an internet family company. Faming company, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. Wait, 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 wait. I'm sorry. Number five. Sorry. Number five. Sorry. Yes, I mixed them. When I buy a new laptop, my old one will be recycled. Yeah, right. Will be recycled. Oops. Since blogging software became available, millions of blogs have been created. Have been created, yes. And there's one in the future called Morasan. Number five. Recycled teacher. Recycled. Oops, I put the U. What the hell? <laughs> okay. 
Got them all right. Tag questions. You remember tag questions, don't you? Yeah. Yes, we do. Yes, I do. Okay. Yes, I do. It would be great if someone figure out how to eliminate spam. Wouldn't it? Wouldn't, Wouldn't it? it? Yes. Wouldn't do, it? Have, do not forget to add a question mark. No capital letters. It's a, Wouldn't. Uh -huh. It seems like kids Would spent. It? Wouldn't it? Yes, really? Because look, it would be great. Wouldn't it? It seems like kids spend too it's much. It, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Or it Last seems. Sunday? Let me finish. Oh, <laughs> That's okay. Uh, it seems like kids spend way too much time playing computer games. Doesn't it? Doesn't, Doesn't it? Doesn't it? Doesn't it? Doesn't it? Me la han cambiado Spanish to English. I mean, the cloud. I hate when people use my keyboard. Okay, number three, those infomercials on TV are so annoying. Aren't they? Aren't they? Aren't they? They're funny, huh? Do you know what is an infomercial? Mm -hmm. What is the difference between an infomercial and a commercial? Yeah, information is a... Uh... Uh, say it's a, a sale, it's exactly, but a sale, a product specific, but a long time. I'm sorry, Alex, we can't hear you. Uh, commercial, but uh, like a second. Can application que no está. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, Alex, we we can't hear you. You get cut. You sound like C-3PO. Okay. Yeah. yeah, I don't know, but maybe I think you have the idea. An infomercial is like a commercial, but it's very long. It's like 30 minutes. Yes. And they're funny too. Mm -hmm. Like, have you ever noticed that you buy many products and it doesn't go away? Well, now we have quick and easy. You just do this, ksh, 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 and it goes away. And then the other person, oh, my God. Mm -hmm. And if you call in the next 30 minutes, we won't give you one. We'll give you two. But no, you know, we'll give you three. It's funny. I can't imagine everybody calling. TV offer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, TV offer. Hey, but you know what? So, some products of TV offer are good. That is true. You know if what you I call? No, I don't call. I went to TV offer. You know what I really, really like? Ya tengo like tres años yendo y nunca tienen, ya no tienen otra vez. Remember those aviator glasses? Mm -hmm. yeah. uh -huh. Those were good. I lost them. But really, when you put them on, I have yeah. a problem. I, I have a problem because when I I'm very sensitive. I'm very sensitive to light. Like at night, the, the lights or the sun, I am very sensitive. And really, when you put those aviation glasses, it's like the commercial. Wow. It was very, very comfortable. I mean, comodos. They were nice. And they were like $30, but really, I recommend those. Mm -hmm. No, they were very, but mm -hmm. había unos, like, nice. They were like, the, the design was yeah. formal. They were very, very nice. I really recommend ah. it. And I told my friends, hey, ponételos, and everybody had the reaction. Wow. Because era cómodo. And so when I go to Metro Centro mm -hmm. or sometimes and I see TV offer, I it's always true. go. No, I always go. Y mire, tienen eso. No, fíjese que puros vendedores de 
No, fíjese que se nos han acabado. Ya tienen como tres años que se las han acabado. En vez de decir, no, ya no las vendemos. <laughs> yeah, but if you ever see the aviator glasses in the TV offer mm -hmm. store, mm -hmm. buy them. They're good. All right. Number four. Flyers aren't good for advertising. Are they? Okay. Are they? Are they? Do you think flyers are good for advertising? Do you know what is a flyer? Not exact, I don't know. Yeah. Volantes? Have you ever volantes? gone like, let's say, met, yes, volantes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like China work. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny because um, frequently in uh, in Los Héroes Boulevard mm -hmm. they have um, masajistas so there's always like beautiful girls giving flyers like for massage <laughs> pero the flyer is very funny because the flyer it says Completely confidential. Eh, eh, ¿Cómo es? Parqueo privado. <laughs> o sea, nada que ver con massage, you know. So. Mm -hmm. and, the, and the girls are very beautiful, the ones that are giving the flyers. So I always tell my wife, we can, we're a client t-shirt. Yeah, I tell my wife, wait a minute, I need a massage. Espérame. Excuse <laughs> me, can I have a, you know. Yeah, but my wife is cool. She doesn't get angry. <laughs> oh, she's cool. I don't get angry too. I'm not jealous. She's not jealous. It's, it's good to have a good relation like that. All right. I hate getting spams. Don't you? Don't you? Good. Don't you? about me I'll be alone dancing you know it baby remember that song okay I hate getting spams don't you do you get spam no you don't get spam email wow good for you I have many or you have a lot of yes have you noticed that in technology now email email, personal email is disappearing. I mean, people now, they only use emails really, really 80% of the time for, for work. But not, now people use WhatsApp to mm -hmm. communicate. Yeah. A person who's willing to work with sick people could be a good nurse. What did you put here? Person willing to work with sick people. Hey. Be a good huh? nurse. Hey, hey, but you said, you said be really be a good nurse. nurse. What happened? What? Hey, teacher. Yes. Is not that we use a ready closes? Yeah. Uh huh. Rewrite? It's reduced. Oh, I'm sorry, you're uh -huh. right. But it's only I see it. Couldn't she or couldn't he? Thank you. You're right. <laughs> hey, miren esto. Willing. Guess willing. <laughs> ¿Quién tienen ustedes? A person who is willing to work with sick people could be a good nurse. What is willing? You know, it's like to have voluntad. Voluntad, yes. Prácticamente es una persona dispuesta a. Dispuesto a. Y como Marvin dice, cuando uno está dispuesto es por voluntad, no por obligación, correct? Yeah. Y se acuerdan cuando les expliqué la diferencia de I will and I'm going to? 
Que I will is a promise or is a compromise. Cuando uno se compromete en algo, es de voluntad, no de obligación. Y aquí es donde va. A person who is willing. Mm -hmm. Example, oh man, I am fat. I need to go to the gym. Yes, but do you have the will? ¿Tienes, tienes el will? ¿Tienes la voluntad de ir? Mm -hmm. No, entonces, then you won't. Yes, it says will. Yes. So what is number one here? In that case, it just is a, a person willing to work without who is. Yes, a person willing to work with sick people could be a good nurse. Mm -hmm. bueno, te hago It, Uy, Sorry. A person, <laughs> a person willing to Sorry. work with. A person willing to work with sick people could be a good nurse. Yes. Yes. A person willing to work with sick people could be a good nurse, could be a good employee. Let's do something. So let me see. A person willing to work with sick people could be a good nurse or person willing to work with sick people could be a good nurse. Malo, this is wrong. That is wrong. No, yes, because this should be people. Mm -hmm. Porque person is one. Tiene que haber artículo como aquí ve. A person. Okay. A person willing to work with sick people could be a good nurse. Una persona dispuesta a trabajar con gente enferma podría ser una buena enfermera. Una persona. Y aquí sería gente dispuesta a trabajar con gente enferma podrían ser buenos nurses. Pero igual está malo porque a person es lo mismo. Sería a person. Oops. Someone who is looking for paid vacations shouldn't be a small business owner. It's the same without who is. Yes, someone looking for paid vacations shouldn't be a business owner. Someone looking for paid vacations shouldn't be a bis uh, small business owner. What is the difference? It's the same. Uh, nothing, yes, it's the same. The same teacher. Yes, yeah, the same. Exactly. Mm -hmm. What I can't answer, person. Ah, uh, maybe. With uh, 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 the point at, at the end, the period. Is the unique difference the period? Oh. Mm -hmm. Well, the maybe. Period. Maybe. But mm -hmm. if, the, if that is the difference, then this is not a complete sentence. <laughs> It's wrong. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Anyone who has a good voice is invited to audition for the core. Aquí se dice core, no se dice chore. Core. Core. Do you, do you know what is a core? Mm -hmm. Yes. Core. When you go to church, you see the little kids or, or people. Ave Maria. You know, the people in the core. A person that uh, the musician? No, it's not a musician. People <laughs> in the core is people mm -hmm. that sing, but not the main singer. Coro, el coro. Mm -hmm. Yes. All right. Number three, anyone who has a good voice is invited to audition for the core. Anyone with a good voice is invited to audition for the core. Anyone? Okay, putting in me. Something's wrong here. Well, number five, someone who is interested in art history might love to work in a museum. This is separate, okay? 
Someone interested in art history might love to work in a museum. Good. I don't know why they put the same answer two times. Maybe you're right. Um, maybe you're right, Alexander, because the second one, they don't have period, look. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're right. Good observation, my friend. Okay, okay. Okay, well, hey, okie dokie, do you know where, ya que dijo eso, do you know where the el nombre de Scooby-Doo viene? Remember Scooby-Doo? Yeah. Yes. Do you know how Scooby-Doo got mm -hmm. his name? No. <laughs> no. It's funny, he got his name from Frank Sinatra. Ah. Uh. Do you, yeah, do you remember Strangers in the Night? Yeah. It's changing. Mm -hmm. Hay una parte ahí que dice es -doo -doo, doo -doo 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 -doo. Yeah, so the person that created hey, Scooby-Doo. <laughs> Le gustó el Dooby-Dooby-Doo, so he put Scooby-Doo. Mm -hmm. That is uh, pop history. <laughs> Pero mm -hmm. Regresando al tema, OK, do you know where OK comes from? Okay. What is OK? OK. OK is yes. Right. Okay is yes, uh -huh. but okay is something positive, correct? Okay. En la guerra, so if you can you, en la guerra. Okay. There was a war. Imagine there's a war and um, I am the, cat, the general from Santa Tecla and I want to know what happened in Soyapango. So I send my messenger. How are you? ¿Cómo estás? And my messenger went to Soyapango. And he went to Soyapango and he says, hey, look, I have a message from the general in Santa Tecla. Oh, let me see. Todo era código, you know. How are you? And then he says, oh, we went to battle, blah, 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 but we are okay. So yeah, but then the, the, the messenger went back to Santa Tecla and he read the letter. He says, oh, okay, they are okay. Okay means zero killed. Uh, zero, uh, okay. yeah, zero killed in battle, in batalla. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey, zero killed. Mm -hmm. And that was good news. And so they say, hey, okay, I received news. So Yapango is okay. Santa Tecla is okay. Santa Ana is not okay, <laughs> you know. Yeah, for Canada, okay, 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 okay. So even in Spanish, or even a palabra uh, international, I think. <laughs> but it was actually, ni era, oh, era cero, cero ca era realmente. OK. Y de ahí viene la famosa mala costumbre. No sé si ustedes tienen clientes o familiares en Estados Unidos, pero ellos suelen decir el número cero como O. En muchos casos. Mm -hmm. Por ejemplo, my telephone number is 740-19. O six O O S O is zero. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Y viene de OK because it's zero killed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. People for who work from this for themselves must be disciplined. 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 Yeah, disciplined. Yes. It okay, takes disciplined. it takes blank. To be a designer. 
mistake. Originally. Originality. Originality. All right, so if you say fast, it's originality. Okay. Okay. But if you can't say it fast, no problem. Say it, I don't know, in three syllables. Keep on repeating. When you feel comfortable in three syllables, say it in two. Keep on repeating. When you feel comfortable in two, say it in one. Okay. I admire Tom. He is blank about what he does. Okay. Passionate. passionate. He's passionate, yes. A technological, uh, technologically company must be? Innovate. Innovative. 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 Yes. Innovative. To survive. Por eso lo que yo le decía, eh, bring ideas to the table. Porque una technology company must be, mm -hmm. se tiene que estar renovando. So a lot of people, like companies, yes. young people today, that's what companies look for. They, they want people they, to bring new ideas, new ideas, new ideas to the table. Number five, blank is a must if you want to be a manager. But what, mean, what means decisiveness exactly? It comes from the side. Mm -hmm. But decisiveness, decisiveness is a must if you want to be a manager. So if you want to be a manager, it's like, I don't know, I cannot say. No, mm -hmm. then that's mm -hmm. not a good manager. Yes. If you want to be a manager, decisive. yeah, you got to be decided. You have to be like, yes, I will do it. Yes. Sin pensarlo, like, yes, because that's what, this is what I want. Mm -hmm. Entonces, decisiveness is decidido. Decidido. Yes. Okay. Teaching requires a lot of Patience. 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 Just a little patience. All right. Guns and Roses. Okay, class, no worries. We'll finish this tomorrow, okay? Just we only have this little things to do and we're finished. All right. So we'll continue tomorrow, okay? Hey, sure. All right. Yes. We want to hear. We want to hear the, the song. Yes, hey. yes, we will. No problem, okay. we will. Okay. Okay? All right, man. Bye. Have a very good night. Thank you very much. You have a great night. Bye-bye. Okay. If, you, if you ever have any questions or whatsoever, um, you can WhatsApp me. The, the tomorrow of the song is, is about the Bad Bunny. No. <laughs> no, because um, I don't understand in Spanish or in English that song. <laughs> Maybe King Flip. Okay. okay. I, pre I prefer King Flip. <laughs> yeah, okay. I do. Okay. Okay. Yes. Okay. Bye bye. Bye bye. 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 Bye.